guess the jab is kind of fab. Uh, if you want to have it, go and get it would be my view. And there's reason for confidence that can come out of, of the vaccination. But there's so much sort of mixed messaging and so forth. And now we're being told we're being bludgeoned into having it because otherwise we're all going to be under some sort of state-based house arrest. This is a nonsense, Bronwyn. Well, Gary, the problem is that the vaccine was meant to be uh, the break in the cycle of fear. I kept saying that China, yep. known, China, the Communist Party not only exported the disease to us, but they exported the fear with it. And the vaccine was supposed to break that cycle of fear. And it was fear that allowed people to accept the lockdown and to, to accept somehow that their freedom could be curtailed in this way. So... What has happened is, because of all the stories that have come out about the vaccine subsequently, um, again, that fear has come back this time, targeted the vaccine, uh, as well as the disease. So we've got a double whammy, if you like. I think the only yeah, way... We have. And, yeah. and I know others have said this too, but it, it's most important to say, I think the only way that you're going to make the vaccine... Um, more readily acceptable is if you give people a choice of what vaccine they can have. That they can have the, uh, yep. uh, you know, the regular vaccine, which is the one we understand vaccines, which has got a bit of the disease in it, and you take that and we know how the body works, or you take one of the new types of vaccine, which is both the Pfizer and the Moderna uh, varieties. Um, new technologies, perhaps we don't know uh, how... how um, they might subsequently turn out, but I think people have to be given that choice. And if you do that, I think you well, see a much greater take-up factor. But it is so important that everyone says that this idea of an internal passport within Australian borders is an anathema to what our founding fathers established with our constitution and the Federation of Australia. That word yeah, absolutely yeah. free yeah. in section 92 mm. was put there for a very good reason. Mm -hmm. And if you go around and look at the border towns where, you know, the, the ex where the customs houses were built, very fine, splendid buildings because we'd take money off each other at, uh, at a great rate yeah. of knots. Uh, and of course, they are a symbol of what we must never let return. We must never again no. have internal barriers. So it's got to be stamped on and stamped on hard. So any time it comes up, yeah. um, with the two premiers at least agreeing on that and saying it hard and fast, we have to say no, no, no. Yeah, but Scott Morrison seems to say it's not off the table yet. Scott Morrison, give yourself the metaphoric uppercut and, and just back down on this, mate. You are on a hiding to absolutely... Nothing on this. Absolutely nothing. Mm. Because Australians don't like to be told. Australians will run the other way. Well, some will. Some will fall into line. 